Hey everyone, Susan Classic here, and I'm bringing you something different. So let me know what you think, and if you want to see more of this or not, please let me know. I'm always welcome, always welcome feedback. Anyway, um, I'm a geek. Now, what does that mean? Or better yet, what does that mean to you? The stereotypical answer to that is, you know, someone who's into comic books, films, video games, tabletop games, you know, that's the basis of a geek, that's a definition, you know, wears glasses, no really little detail about what issue, what film, what actor, what director, yeah. And to an extent, that does describe me, but does that fully describe who I am as a geek? I can't, I can't say it does, to be honest. I honestly, well, no, it doesn't, it doesn't define who I am, it doesn't, it doesn't describe exactly what I am as a geek. Because, for example, I love mixed martial arts. I've been doing mixed martial arts for the past, on and off for the past five years. And anytime someone mentions mixed martial arts, or they do mixed martial arts, or they watch mixed martial arts, I geek out. Now, that term, look out for that term, geek out. When you say you geek out, by all intents and purposes, you are a geek. Because you have that love, that passion for something that you can't really explain to people, and you try to, but sometimes they just don't get it. So if it, so what I'm saying is to be a geek, you just got to have a love, a passion that you just want to express and share with everyone. For example, my sister is a writer and she's an artist. So every detail when it comes to writing and artistry, she geeks out. She loves the types of paper you get for writing and drawing, the pens, the artists, in who, the artists that inspire her, the writers that inspire her. You know, that's why she does a blog. So I'll, say, I'll leave a link for that in the description. My girlfriend, Anna, she's an animator. So anything animated related, she just geeks out about. Like we went to see Kubo the other day and the stop motion, animation involved in that she she freaked out she wanted to show it she wanted to share it with me she wanted to do everything so i would understand what she loves about it that's what being a geek means you you express you share your love for people you know you share your love of the things that not a lot of people know about so and there's nothing wrong with that a lot of times people will, will you explain to certain people and they make you feel different you make you feel you know, strange, and you know, if that's your friend, that's what you're trying to describe it to. Sad truth is, they're not your friend. You know, friends should say one or two things. One, that sounds really cool. Tell me more. Or two, that's not my thing. Sorry, but it's really not something I'm into. Fair enough. You, that's those are two things you should, should hear from a friend. If they try to make you feel that small, that's kind of stupid. That's kind of thing. They ain't your friend, man. You don't need that person telling you or bringing you down because you have a love or something they can't understand. Be a geek, people. Express it exchange with exchange with exchange with others you know just embrace what makes you happy because that's what being a geek really means at the end of the day is being happy having a passion and love for something where you can all come together and just talk about your love of this one thing so that's where i stand on what is a geek um let me know what you think leave a comment leave a like leave whatever you want whatever makes you happy but share it you know leave some feedback let me know what you think that's all i really want to know hope you have a great day later